Okay, for the geometry control, I mean if customer has a tolerance. Now I I alignment lastly on the perpendicular plane, right? But I go back to the the speed measurement better. When I finish alignment, I just uh, show the result by the middle click and put the mouse here and then drag the annotation like this. And if I want to change the tolerance, I just select whatever I want to change, like circle. If all the circles are the same tolerance, select all. And then this is the icon for editing the parameter we call geometry controls. Sorry, I'm not familiar with your mouse. <laughs> This icon is to add or remove the dimensional control. When you click, this will open for you, like circle for all the tolerance, how much you want to put. You just select or right click, edit controls. And then you put upper and lower, suppose uh, 5, 5, and no minus, just 0. Something like that. There will be some error here. And if, I'm not sure you probe, circle only three points, right? Uh, yeah, three points. So you can't show that. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, I know. Uh, plane, plane maybe can show. Okay. When you click plane, geometry control, you can add GD and T. The second icon, all the signs will be here for the plane. You can check surface profile, you can check the parallelism, but you need to have another plane to compare. But by form error is flatness. You just put the tolerance 0 0.2. This is a how to change the parameter inside the geometry control and add the GDNT. For the circle also, you can add the two position. Position of uh, circularities. Okay, suppose I finish my my measurement, I can use this icon like distance, click, and then I click one time, one, two, and drag the direction here. Just put the mouse here. Now you get the distance here. You can continue one, two, and drag the direction. One, two. Like this. Angle? Angle, yes, can. Angle will be another one. Suppose I have a distance like this. And I have the circle too. Okay. And I want to make uh, this picture as a report. I just arrange everything, finish, and then I click this one. Create control view from objects in the 3D scene. Sorry, I cannot see the word. <laughs> you can put the name, any name, or just let it uh, control view one, just create. Now you have the report with, with the table and the picture. Picture first and then table. Suppose I, I turn the picture like this and have many move, but I want to, to see my, my control view that I already take just now. I just click here is a control reviewer. This is our control, but I have one control view here. This will come for you. Like every time you want this to be up here that I already locked. This will automatic show for you. This will come with the total like 22 measure, fail 6, like this, uh, fail 6, 5, 6, yes. This will automatic analyze for you. Suppose if I change the tolerance, circle, 
I change to one and then minus one. This is automatic update. No need to take picture again. This one auto update inside. Can I resize this picture so that I can bring the table up? Yes, can. You can double click to crop, make it smaller like this. It's like a PowerPoint or something like this. I think you create some report template. No? I'm not sure. Maybe you can put it uh, as a cover. I'm not sure. It depends on your design. Okay, next is this is a distance. Okay, distance and Another one is angle. I have a plane two and plane one. This one. This. When I want to create the angle, I just click the icon angle. Just now is the distance, yeah. and now is the angle. Same method. You just click two times, one, two, and choose the direction, which one you want. Suppose I click here. And I think, oh, I'm wrong, not this side, another side. So no need to do it again. You just open the geometry control and check the another angle here, like this. Because when you measure, click one time, you get four angles. Depends on your show, like this one. Angle one or angle two. Ah. Yeah. We, we cannot change this only a uh, degree. You have to calculate. <laughs> so it's only degree. Yes. Uh what else? Uh, I, yeah. just a quick question. Yes. On the angle, uh, how many decimal points can we get or how do we set the number of decimal points uh, depends on user. Yeah. <laughs> By click on this one, setting you see. Yeah. Setting a edit format. This one you can put six decimal. Uh, it's here. Yeah. I just want to find where it is. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> good. This is good. Normally it's two or three. And we have uh, this view, we just uh, maybe I, uh, this one, and then control view again. Click. This is uh, maybe I type and go. When I see the report, it's automatic picture and table. But this table is uh, too many information, so cannot be the same page. And I want to see the control view. I just Click here, we have two now. This one or this one. Very easy to see the view. Question? Okay, I think this one is good. 